and then there were four. Two candidates have gone in three days. The debate stage now a little bigger, the nomination prize a little closer. The first question on a topic that dominated the day. Allegations former Speaker Newt Gingrich asked his ex-wife for an open marriage to allow him to carry on an affair. Visibly angry, he responded. I think, I think the destructive, vicious, negative nature of much of the news media makes it harder to govern this country harder to attract decent people to run for public office. And I am appalled that you would begin a presidential debate on a topic like that. We acquired the grew and became Mitt more Romney has been the front runner, but has seen his lead and, uh, swallowed up. He's West been attacked country. for his role With in an investment firm which created jobs, but also laid off workers. From him, a strong defense. There's nothing wrong with profit, by the way. I, I'm someone who believes in free enterprise. I think Adam Smith was right, and I'm going to stand and defend capitalism across this country throughout this campaign. I know we're going to hit it hard from President Obama, but we're going to stuff it down his throat and point out it is capitalism and freedom that makes America strong. Just noted, Rick Santorum recently found out he Iowa actually Iowa not only and won the Iowa caucus at the beginning of the month, but, um, and so dismissed the suggestion you know, these, from Newt Gingrich he get out of the race. <laughs> Grandiosity has never been a problem with Newt Gingrich. He, he, he handles it very, very well. I'm not the most flamboyant, and I don't get the biggest applause lines here, but I'm steady, I'm solid. I'm not going to go out and do things that you're going to worry about. I'm going to be out there. I'm going to make Barack Obama the issue in this campaign. Ron Paul is running a distant third in South Carolina and got little time in the debate here, something acknowledged by the audience. Before we move on, you want in on this issue? They want you in on this issue. Would you like in on this issue? <laughs> but when he did, he returned to familiar campaign themes. Look at some of the overseas spending that we don't need to be doing. We have, we have troops in Korea since, world, and since the Korean War, in Japan since World War II, in Germany since World War II. Those are subsidies to these countries. And we keep fighting these wars that don't need to be fought. Let's continue the race this was a fiery debate, the manners of early contests set aside, as the reality of what's at stake comes into states. sharp focus. But most will remember only the first state. two minutes. Newt Gingrich's fierce reaction to questions about well, his personal well, life, start, trying to put a difficult CNN issue behind him, and save his candidacy. Alan Fisher. Al Jazeera, South Carolina. Well, earlier, my colleague Amike Umolu spoke to Todd Kent, a former Republican pollster and the current assistant dean of Texas A&M University, Qatar. Well, I think this idea of electability is going to be more and more important. Uh, a lot of people will go with their favorite candidate, but in the end, Republicans want to de defeat Obama, so they're going to look for the person that's more electable. And currently, uh, when you do head-to-head -head matchups with Obama, that would be Romney. So that would play to Romney, uh, or it would strengthen Romney as we move through the spring, because Republicans in the end want to win, and uh, they will look for somebody that's electable. Of course, and in Iowa a few weeks ago, things were fluid until the 11th hour. The winner kept changing throughout. Is there an indication that we could see another tight finish this time around? Well, I think there, you know, the, the, the latest polls in South Carolina show it could be a very close race. Uh, I think that if it's a close race, that's good for Gingrich. What it's also going to mean is the third and fourth candidates, Santorum and Paul, the one, the one who does best in South Carolina, sets himself up to be the third candidate. And it may, it may be uh, close to the end for the whoever finishes fourth. But uh, uh, this is the I next 10 days are important with South and Carolina I and then Florida. Because if we remember, Florida is the, is the state that are, the Republicans have to win if they're going to win the, uh, the presidency next November.